What's going on Collider Games fans? I'm Caboose and today what I got for you guys here is an official tease for what seems to be a fan favorite character that is looking like he's going to return in Mortal Kombat 11. So Ed Boon took it to Twitter last night to put out a very cryptic tweet as he usually does and with this tweet it read the caption of a quote that said who hired this guy dot 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 WTF. Hashtag Mortal Kombat 11 and attached to that caption with that tweet was a photo of what looked to be a little zoomed in and it's somebody giving us the bird and it has a bit of a cracked screen there. Now if we kind of reach far and wide into the Mortal Kombat lore, there's really only one character who does this kind of stuff and his name is Johnny Cage. And in the photo that Ed Boon tweeted out, it definitely matches the attire of what we see of Johnny Cage in the actual gameplay reveal trailer for Mortal Kombat 11. Johnny Cage can be seen in that trailer as one of the background characters for one of the stages that they showed off. And I know some people started to say, well, hey, he is a background character. Does that mean he's not going to be in the game because, you know, he's just sitting there in the background? Definitely not the case. You know, there have been a lot of instances in the past where background characters ended up being playable. You know, Martian Manhunter comes to mind from Injustice Gods Among Us. And also, in MK11, Kano is a background character for one of the stages. So, there's definitely no doubt that characters who may be in the background for a stage or two can still be playable characters on the roster as Kano is confirmed to be a playable character. And yeah, like I said, you know, the attire that he's, that the character is wearing in this photo that Ed Boon tweeted out very much matches what Johnny Cage is wearing in the background of that stage from the gameplay reveal trailer. So it looks like that Ed Boon here is indeed teasing that Johnny Cage will be in the game. And I mean, come on, there's nobody out there who expected this wouldn't be the case. Johnny Cage is one of the more iconic Mortal Kombat characters, and it would be a serious missed opportunity to not include him in this game, especially considering we've got Sonya Blade and we've got got Cassie Cage revealed through the behind the scenes trailer so how are you not going to be able to complete the Cage family you know they had all three of them in Mortal Kombat X no way they're not going to include Johnny in this game I'm also guessing that because Ed Boon is putting out this tease here, it might be that we're getting a reveal for the character sometime soon. I don't know when there's scheduled to be another combat cast. I believe it's supposed to be next week. If I can find out more details, you will see another video detailing all that information right here on Collider Games. But whenever they do plan another reveal through the combat cast or whatever it may be, it's probably going to end up being for Johnny Cage, considering that Ed Boon's putting out these teases for the character. But that's it for the quick Mortal Kombat 11 news that we got for today. And now we're going to kick it to you guys. Let us know your thoughts in the comment section below. Would you be excited for Johnny Cage to be making his return in MK11? I want to hear your thoughts in the comments. And of course, if you enjoyed this video, a positive rating would be appreciated. And you can subscribe to the Collider Games channel for more gaming coverage. I've been Caboose, and I'll see you guys later.